How to turn on geolocation in Civil 3D. If you're working on a project in Civil 3D and need to navigate your model using real-world locations, you're probably wondering how to turn on the geolocation feature. Let's break it down step by step. First, you need to ensure you're using a version of Civil 3D that supports geolocation. This feature is available in Civil 3D 2015 and later versions, which are built on the AutoCAD platform. To start, you might need to add the geolocation tab to your Civil 3D workspace. By default, this tab is not included in the Civil 3D workspace, so you'll need to do some customization. Open your Civil 3D drawing and go to the Customize User Interface, CUI dialog box by typing CUI in the command line. In the CUI dialog, highlight the workspace you want to modify, usually the Civil 3D default workspace. Click on Customize Workspace, then expand the Partial Customization Files collection and navigate to the ACAD collection. Here, you'll find the ribbon section. Expand it and locate the Geolocation tab. Check the box next to it to add it to your workspace. Click Done, then Apply and OK to save the changes. Now that you have the Geolocation tab, you can access it from the ribbon. Click on the Geolocation tab to start using its features. Next, you need to set up your drawing settings to work with geolocation. Go to Edit Drawing Settings and set your units and zone. For example, if you're working in Illinois, you would select the US Illinois State Plain NAD 83 East Zone US Foot Coordinate System. To use a property address to navigate your model, you'll need to enter the address and convert it into latitude and longitude coordinates. Open the geolocation tool by typing geographic location in the command line. This will prompt you to set a location for your map. Enter the address, and the tool will take you to that location using aerial imagery similar to Google Earth or Bing Maps. Once you're at the correct location, you can drop a marker and capture the latitude and longitude coordinates. These coordinates can then be used to zoom into the exact spot in your Civil 3D model using the Zoom command with the Center option. Make sure your latitude and longitude settings are set to decimal format in your drawing settings. By following these steps, you can easily turn on and use the geolocation feature in Civil 3D to navigate your model using real-world addresses and coordinates. This tool is incredibly useful for positioning yourself accurately within your project area and accessing aerial map information directly within Civil 3D.